So the game in this video is made by the creator of Patrick's Parabox, which is a really well-known recursive puzzle game, and uh, Stephen Miller, who's made a bunch of these smaller but also really good puzzle games. Hey everyone, welcome to Patrick's Heron Box. No, I'm not kidding. It's by Patrick and Stephen Miller. Um, they think of Puzzle Jam 2, and I played like two levels of it. There's no music, I think, which is I think a little uh, sad, but anyway. So the mechanic of this is the hats. Anything under a hat becomes uh, transparent and you can walk through it. And there's also this hair. So we gotta solve it by putting the hair on the carrot. Um, okay. I guess I need to exit. Okay. Here, and level two. So this is similar. We get the hat here. But also, that becomes transparent as well if I put the uh, rabbit on there. So the rabbit has to go here. No. No, the hat goes here. The rabbit goes there. And then I push the hat back. So now we have the hair in box. Okay. So now we've got to the real part, um, the real game that I have, like that I haven't seen yet. Oh, that's it. How do I tell if what? Oh, if I'm transparent, I can go through that as well. Interesting. Um, but yeah, I don't know how I can like distinguish between. Oh, I can't push this up. That's an interesting consequence of that. But I don't know how I can distinguish between walls and connected. I guess these are all not connected to each other. So I want to push the hat out. Do we do the same thing here? Hmm. Well, I'd like to do the same thing here. This is a very reminiscent of... Oops. Yeah. Why does it remind me of this puzzle from Parabox? Anyway, let's just put it in. So level four. What is that? Okay, so the massive chain of hats. I gotta get rid of all of them. Oh my gosh, that's ridiculous. What is that go- Hmm. I wonder how far I can, like, mess with the walls there, but... We gotta get rid of all these to... What? Wow. I just stacked two on top of each other. That, um, that wasn't good. You know, unstack it. What is going on there? I can't seem to... Okay, get the... Get these off. Get these off, so we can do a hat trick. There we go. What was that? That worked. Okay, that worked. Um, very strange. Also, I like how the hat in the hat tricks is, like, phantomized. That's a moon. So we can't get rid of the whole thing. We can try that, though. Just to try to get an open space, I guess. Hmm. So that doesn't do anything. How do we get that? Oh my, you can even move into other blocks while transparent? I didn't realize that. Okay, so there's that. That's a big box, and we got more than one player because, of course, we do. Okay. And then push that out. Okay, here we go. That's a very oddly shaped thing down there. Oh. Hmm. So does any position work or what? I'm not really sure about that. Nope. I want to get in there, but... Guess I need to do it, like, one before there, there. but no, it doesn't let, really let me enter it. Hmm. I don't know what to do here. Must I push it inside here or something? Well, now they combined. Oh. It's a sort of really... There we go, okay. Oh, no. Well... The mentality was there. So now we got eight. That didn't do anything. We looks like we gotta try to move this off the wall because of why else would it look like this? But you, you do it in a way that like undoes the hat? Hmm. Oops. Well, that didn't look good. Okay. Maybe down here. No. What? I can move it while inside here. Um, that seems relevant, but I also don't know how to do use that. So we can move it while I'm inside the hat. Okay, that's what I'm going for. But I can't move this hat anymore, so maybe that's not a good idea. Hmm. Phantom. So what, should I have moved it up instead? Well, not there, but here. No. Well, it still fails. Jeez. Hmm. Go here, but that's not useful. It's gotta be the thing about being able to enter and then... There! That should be good, right? 
And now, I'll do the same thing, but... Hmm, that wasn't good. That wasn't good either. Hmm. How did I do it before? There was a way before. Yes, it was this. There we go. Okay. Nine. Cats. So we can null both hats and some sort of bad idea. Um, super bad idea. Well, we want the other one now. Can I cancel one of those? I mean, cancel the one I've already placed. Also, like, how do I move this hat? What's it for anyway? Okay, the side hat megaphone. Okay, that doesn't look good. I mean, if I can get both of the hats at the same place, that'd be cool too, right? Not literally like that, I guess. Okay. That's like my only idea, and it seems like it's just what we're supposed to do, so there we go. Classic, 18. Also, the meta stuff in this hub seems less hidden than anything else. Is this the equivalent of a closed Epsilon? Or <laughs> Anyway, this actually looks more like a sticky mechanic, so you get that. Well, nice, that's the level. <laughs> but even compare that to... Um... Okay, this is like a meme. This is not even like the anything close to the Phantom Hat mechanic. Um, anyway, so these, like, you stick to the hat... And, uh, you want to do that down here, too. Not really sure what the hat's for. Does it get in the way, or even help you at all? Hmm. Guess you need it here, so you can push to the right. Okay, and even kind of sticks... Well, hmm. Oh. So we become sticky, too. Um... Not just we stick to the hat, but we also become sticky here. Don't really know how to dismount this. Um, or even if we like change the positions, uh, flipping us versus the hat. We can only stick in that direction though, so I'm not that satisfied with it. We're obviously doing this to try to stick to that, right? How do you even get that in? That's nuts. Okay, it's sticking too hard. Let's not stick too hard. Okay, that's not happening. What's what's with this puzzle? I can do that. Maybe get it in this way. Although, I'd like to just normal push it right now. And then what? Oh, that does not work. And there's no other way to make this happen either. So, no, no, we can do this. Cool. Maybe. Do we need to be inside? I don't know. I don't know anymore. I'd like to be inside there, but that doesn't work. Alright. We need a right push, though. It's like I need to be inside, but I also don't understand. Wait, what the? Okay, that... I didn't expect that for some reason. <laughs> um, not that I understand if that can help, but yeah. So this will make the entire thing sticky. Which is nice, um... Wait, this is it. We just make the whole thing sticky. There we go. Just totally missed that. And now what? Hat. Go down. That doesn't work very well. Well, maybe I could use, still use the hat. Who knows? I get it up. And that causes me to be sticky, which causes that to be sticky. Okay, I kind of like that, but... Okay, not this. Not whatever this is right now. Okay, I think I'm stuck. Hmm, none of that was helping. Okay, reset. So this gold hat doesn't have phantom properties at all. So, really know what to do here. Hmm. Okay, gotta know. Is it this? Because... Nope, doing that doesn't cause any motion with the walls. As I would have kind of expected. What if we bring this in first? Does that help? No. Seemingly not. Damn it. Like, does not stickiness? No, it doesn't even look like it infects the walls at all. So I can't do some sticky stuff with that. Wow, I don't get this at all. Like, 
What setup could I possibly do to bring that back out? I've tried that before, haven't I? It's not really been working out. It's not sticky enough. I guess I haven't used the very top part of that thing yet. Just like, I don't know. Okay. Okay, so we stick that. That's literally just because I was like, oh, I didn't use the top. So therefore... Two hairs? I guess I gotta get both. Do I need the assistance of the other hat? Because, um... This thing is, like, not helping. Or I try to get this behind me, I don't know. I don't know. Hmm. Well, let's try to detach that. Luckily, I'm sticky too. Gotta remember that I am also. Um, and I guess if I can go up here, this will just win. Alright. 15. That's a lot of hairs in box. I guess I must create a chain of these so I can move this down. No. Why is it not working? Hmm. Thought that was what we're going for. Maybe that one has to be like above or something, in which case, gotta do that first. I should be sticky to- why is that not happening? Does it only propagate once? I don't really understand what's happening with that. It only propagates once. Then what? That's not even like the last thing- well, no. Maybe it's the- maybe the joke is that I get a- I get the hat itself. Separated from the other thing. So I can dismount. And then my last move is doing this hat thing. Also, it's impossible to not notice the wall interacting if you think like this. But, whatever. So we gotta get this, maybe? Oops. That sticks it in a not-so-nice way. Hmm. Wish I could do something more with that, you know? But, I'm just gonna go up. I can't dismount it like that, seemingly. Okay. Not really sure what to do with that. I would really like to do this or something like that. Dismount. Well, we wish to dismount anyway. And that, and like, conveniently, the freaking hat doesn't go in the right... Well, I mean, the other hair doesn't go in the right place conveniently. Great. Now I need another thing to dismount. That was not a good idea. Hmm. Wait, can I just do it this way instead? That- oh my gosh, look at this. Look at this nonsense. Look, we gotta have the hairs down in the right place for the, um, thing to work. So we gotta switch them around, I guess. Even gods unlocked. Okay. So, how do I get the thing I wanted? Hmm. But, it seems like this one isn't the the fitting one for what I want out of a dismount. Maybe I do this first? No, no, no. Oh, this one definitely needs to be the top one now that I've discovered this, you know? Hmm. Can I dismount this? No, because then that gets stuck hard. Hmm. Go here. Get that. Is that good? Is it? I can get completely off that, but I'm not satisfied. Yeah, I'm not satisfied. Do I do this first and then this later? That requires another type of dismount to get this working. This is just the same thing. What am I missing here? How do I not have this happen? Um, from here we could try... That looks really bad. Don't don't do it. I'd like to not have that, please. Things are just failing for me constantly here. And swap around the order, which is a little interesting, but ultimately don't think it's working. I don't get better results by flipping the, around the directions, will I? I don't know. Well, now this doesn't even do anything. I can do that. Still needs a place to be down and not stuck. Okay, I've spent quite a bit on this puzzle. Um, and like fundamentally it's about 
like retaining having two boxes hmm, in different spots after you dismount. I don't know how I'm gonna have that happen. Hmm. Also, don't know if I can like recover this. That nah, cannot. Okay. Nope. Gosh, this is so close. I just need to like push down on the hat, but. How close is this, really? Jeez, I don't know what I did wrong. Um, I mean, I need to get something out to begin with, but... That thing that I just did seemed, like, really close. I just... Don't know how I did it, I guess. Wait, do I have it? So, I, like, I do this to try to get it in this form, right? And then I dismount that way. Which looks almost failing, but I can push down to break that. And finally I've got it. Oh my gosh, that took me ridiculously long. <laughs> anyway, 16. Maybe I shouldn't have gone the side branch. Oh well. Um, got this gold again. I really don't know if sticking to walls is going to be relevant, but... Okay. Hmm. I can do that. I mean, that's just like what I feel is relevant. But does it really help, though? Move this down, maybe. I don't know, I'm just like... Putting that in, and not looking good. <laughs> like, why else is that area there? Maybe that? Hmm. We seem to be on winning. Well, that's not winning. Okay. Let's not, then. I can do that. Nope, not really. Hmm. That hat's in the way now. Pretty badly in the way. But also, how else do you win? I guess it would be nice if that, like, stayed there. Um, down below. But I don't think it's gonna happen. Maybe the hat does not go there immediately. I mean, kind of makes sense. But, yeah, like, I wanted to do something like this. Um, but, now it's, like, showing its age, I guess. Oh! We got it, maybe. I think we I think we do. Just gotta get this out now. Okay. Cool. Seventeen. What is that? Why do we have a sock? A sock hat. Anyway. I wanted to move stuff up, I guess. That might not work as well. But still, I don't know why it like, looks like this. Hmm. Why sock hat? Look, can we do do it better by moving it here or something? We can do that to already move it, it into place, but now I can't dismount this properly, I think. Well, I can do that. Wait, that looks really good. What was the mega hat for? I don't get it. And now I gotta go to 18 to look at this. So, double players again. Air stays in there normally, and we're back to uh, normal phantoms, which is nice. I don't know if we're going to stay here. It does seem like we're going to try to stay in. And this big rigid. We also got this one shape thing. Very strange. Uh, that, that, that cannot move normally. Okay. Got to think about how... Okay, so it looks like this part is easy, but the left part is not easy. Don't know what that's for. Can we get a hat in there? Mm hmm. Like, we really want that to be Phantom or something, but I think it's gonna happen. This can't push down. We can go in, but does it really do anything? So it can be inside a hat due to the, how this works. Is there really. We can stack players, too. Sure. I don't see how that work, uh, really helps, though. I don't know. Part of me wants to th say that, like, I've already messed up if, like, I get here and don't have anything on that hat. But I also don't know how to move this hat down at all. It seems like it's not actually possible. And, like, what about this thing? That makes it feel like, like there's, there's something to do with this one, but I don't see it either. Wait, can I go through and push down? Interesting. 
Well, now it's like... Hmm. So, it seems like you gotta take care of this first. Whatever it is. I don't know if we use the hat to, like, hide in here. What? Oh, we never, we never move it back. Okay. Okay, I was, like, really confused. I thought we had to push it in and then move it back. No, we just never move it into that, using that trick. Um, so, I can go inside that. I don't know if those are designed to be blockades or whatever. Hmm. That didn't work. This mechanic is interesting. Okay, I just don't see how... Something about this lets me get through the tunnel, yeah? But I don't know how. I guess like there's like something strange about how we were able to do stuff like this, which is really interesting. And, um... And, like, it exposes some parts of the place. And maybe I could interpret that as some sort of way to get things unlocked. How would you move that down, though? This hat seems, like, pretty lost. That's not good. Hmm. Just, like, trying to take advantage of this thing. But that hat that's facing upwards is not a good one. Not a good spot right now. It would be nice if, like, this actually did something. This is so odd, this behavior. Look at this. Oh my gosh, that's it. That's literally... Yeah, so basically there was no good use for this thing, so it had to be used for something weird. I just... And it's just this. It's to make some sort of crazy freaking tunnel over here. Wow. Unbelievable. 21. 20. 1 minus 1. I could just kind of hide that, but. Hmm. I am not really satisfied. Hmm. So we can go back and try to hide more stuff. But. I don't know. That doesn't look good to me. Wait, the only way to justify this is some sort of overlap trick. Um, I'm not sure it's going to work as intended. It might, like, leave the other one behind. So, okay. Leaves the other one behind. Which means... For this one to work, I gotta do it here. But otherwise, it's all fine. And everything is all fine. Okay. So I guess I gotta undo a bunch because... I also need to set this part up, but this one has the has the thing pushing it, so I think everything should be fine from here. What? Why is it failing? Hmm. What? This worked before because because we had an empty space there. Wow, this is like tightly designed, isn't it? Hmm. That was the reason I could uh leave safely there, but now I cannot. Must I put the hat, like, one to the right of this setup? Because everything seems like, perhaps, it could be all one to the right and we'd have no problem. And then this would be empty? Yes, very nice. So if I do this, that would make that go out, but nope, there we go. 21. That's it. One just, just, uh, must they share it? They probably must share the carrot. So... Okay. Something like that, except... You know, kind of worried that... Oh! Well, I'm well, all right, lucky. No, I'm not lucky. Hmm. That's a way to get that, but what about the other one? It's a little uh, impossible. Even with the hat... No, wait, the hat will help. No, it won't. Jeez, what am I missing here? Can't seem to overlap properly, and... What's, what's it supposed to be? The hat also overlaps and gets inside that, or what? Guess that's what's it, what it is. Okay, here we go. So that side section solved. How much more do we have to go? 22. Ah, we've combined the gold and 
the platinum vest. So the ultimate vest streak. So... Hmm. What am I missing here? How do I go through any of this? We can do that, but... I think, I think what I really want is just to move all this stuff, right? Whoops. Like, I don't like that it's like this. But what else can I do? That That's, like, not real. What? Sure, it can stick through phantom stuff. Why not? Well, I think that's a little forced, but... Now what? How do we even go all the way down? That's, like, pretty ridiculous. What is that? Doubly affected? What is this? Okay. And they can go in. No. No. Um. Well, that moved the silver hat, which was the whole po point, was to move it. But we want the, we want it down here. So do we have to go in again or something? Here. Fine. We don't, we just need to go back a little bit. There's the sock hat again. Hmm. Oh, really? It's there just to be annoying. All right. Hmm. And what about this? We don't stack these, I think. We can do that in order to let... No. So getting that is an issue. Hmm. We can skip over this to do that. But that skip over doesn't really last for long, I think. We'd really want to skip over in a way where I can push up on that. Or alternatively try to get to the side as much as possible with this idea. Problem is that becomes completely not push. And therefore immovable there. So I don't know if this is like the correct time um, whoops, to do it. But I really want to see if this idea has ever worked ever. Well, now I need that to get out, which isn't really possible, so maybe this idea is just dead. Uh, but I was hoping to push it down after moving that there. Hmm. Wait, I could do that elsewhere, right? No? Hmm. I could put that here. That's like the same problem. Okay, this is... I don't know why I'm even trying this. Uh, I don't know. Just try to find a way to push that up, which seems like the hardest so far. Unless, unless it really is about these freaking rabbits. Maybe they, I don't know, maybe their stickiness um, is multi-directional. No, it isn't. Don't you think maybe we displace that gold sock or whatever? It's gonna be hard to do that, though. But at least, like, it's a source of stickiness. Oh, nice. Nice way to get that up. So we can do this to combine the hat thing, which is actually good for this scenario. However, you'll need a way to push down. I don't know if like it will be sufficient to just use the existing phantom property, but hopefully it is. Okay, nice. 24. Now we got us a nice silver stock there. Can even go inside and smell it. Um, anyway, that needs to go up and kind of around. Looks like the, I don't know what that sock's doing. Stickiness would be nice. Or even be able to go through in that scenario. So that weird double motion. I don't know if that's just there to like... No, oh, how do I how does this even get out of here? I don't even understand what the point of it is. Because something will always be fan phantom with it, and I don't know if this this other box even get used there. Okay, I mean the only other idea is that this is used for a combination. Um, well, that's a thing. And I can get through like this. Okay. That doesn't but okay, but I but I love the but I love the hat though. 
I don't want to lose it. Dang, dang it. Maybe I was forced to. Although, you know, this would be probably better if it was the other way around with our combo, but yeah, that's not working. However, I'm entranced by the idea. Let's get the... Let's get that first, maybe? Okay, now they've reversed in a different order. I can barely get them off. Hmm. Okay, maybe that wasn't good. And, uh, can't seem to move that out. Okay, so what, what, if it's not combination, then what was that for? Wait, I did it wrong. Oh, I just did it wrong. Wait. Hmm. I was trying to get it so that I was in here, and, well, I guess to do that I would need them dismounted like that. Maybe not as easy as it appears. Yeah, like this. That's what I was trying to do. And there we go. Jeez, I didn't realize that I went to a different, worse position. So now those are like phantom, but maybe there's a way I can get them out. Yeah, cool. This is some... This is some hardcore overlapping stuff that's happening right now. Like going right through the walls and everything. However, we only have one hair, so... That wall's getting in the way. It'd be nice to like completely leave the playing field or something while doing this. Um, I need to be alive. Also, like I've, I've done this perfectly. Too perfectly. Oh my gosh, this is ridiculous. Whatever I'm doing, I am permanently like this. Okay. So we need a way to dismount. This is like so spaghetti. Um, so we want to do this. Um, somehow control it. And then also that dismounts us somehow. Currently, nothing is getting dismounted here. Um, so, wow. I do wonder if I'm ever involved in this. Seems like it might suck to do so. See, like, it looks like a fail, but actually, getting it stuck like that is a sign that you haven't completely lost it. And, like, can still control stuff, um, but eventually get it out at the end. This is not one of those cases. It's a rage put moment, bye. So yeah, it's been months since I've played this game because this level completely stymied me. Had to get a little refresher on the rules by going back. But okay, I can split the hats by doing this. It feels like the level design is clearly saying they're supposed to like put one hat here and then later there'll be a hat below. We also want the bottom hat though. I can only dismount by doing that, which is yeah, that is a little not wanted. It's too tempting to do this and break the whole level, um, but it's not good to do that. I think this level is pretty hard to visualize and consider. Um, like, maybe you want a hat here and here, but obviously separating them is the problem after that. Like, if you want to do this, then you have to separate... You can do this and separate it elsewhere. As long as we do it, what, below here, we might be fine? Well, I say fine, but that's not the word to use here. I think this is a level that if you don't have a good idea of what your fail states are, you can very clearly um, get really lost. And I think this box here, it's like, it's being used in almost a paraboxy faction here, where I'm supposed to do- No, don't stick! Like, do that, right? And like, that has split us off from sticking to the golden hat. And I can do that. Well, and now I gotta do it with this hat and push this down somehow. I'm not, kind of not looking forward to that because it seems hard, but okay. Yeah. Hmm. I can hold it. Isn't this the same problem that we had before where there's no way to get this off? Hmm. So I want it to stay like the other one, right? Like I do this. Oh, no, no, wait. I can maneuver around it. Maybe. Please? Please? Um... 
Hmm. I noticed the hat is in the way. You can do that. Ah, that's not good either. Hmm. Like, I don't know. Maybe there. You can actually go in here, which is funny. There might be some sort of spaghetti solution where you allow it to happen and move this away or something. Because from here, this is still available. We can dis we can still dismount this. It's just not in any good place to do so. It just seems inelegant though. Like it, it really looks like the hat over here. You would want it to not have a gold hat near it. Like, I noticed that you could do this, which means we can actually get out of it again, and then maybe control through a corner. Um, but if that's good, then you would really want to do that to get control of it again. We can even move this out, actually. Hmm. So we can get out, move this out, and now I'm underneath controlling? Is that better? Oh, dear. Oh, no. <laughs> uh... Yeah, you can't move down from here because there's not enough transparent blocks because again, that's stacked on walls. Spaghetti system. <laughs> oh, come on, that is so close. We just need to not, what, screw up the phantom hat on this one? But if we do this, we can get it to be phantom here, but only temporarily get it out. Oh my gosh, you've got to be kidding me. We need to do this with, um... Wait, no, that means that the Phantom Hat legitimately just needs to be out of there. So it needs to be stuck in this wall first, and then the hat leaves, which is another, uh, ridiculous restriction. Like, it's hard to make it happen. Oh, never mind, it isn't. <laughs> oh, that is... That's a level, all right. All right, let's see if we can get the rest of these. So, this is the... Oh, this is the classic Sokoban. I can just pull all of them out, huh? So this is the classic Sokoban trick. Um, not sure how competently I did it there, but it's usually like you, you do this and then move one of the blocks to the side. I think it's a reference to that because we've seen it so... Well, I've seen in so many games about block pushing, but it might not be as, as easy this time. I mean, we can pull the hat out, but that adds more spaghetti. It seems like a better position than before, though. Hmm... You can move both those down like this. Okay, but if you do this, you want to move both of them back. Err, but you can do this. I can stick. No, there you go. 27. What do we have here? We have a phantom hat facing this way. And a sticky hat here. Hmm. So, there's already a rabbit on its carrot. So, I probably want a phantom hat exactly here. But how do you do that without ruining the... Uh, the rabbit is what I'm going to assume the issue will be. Oh. Well, right now the problem is also... How do you make this the the state of the wall that is phantomed away? You can also try to go infinite again like this. I say infinite in this very, like, meme -y way. And it's, it's, not, it's not really true, but... Like, being able to go pseudo anywhere is kind of that. Mmm, that's kind of close. Uh, like, I don't know if the box needs to be in the way or something, if that's just it. As I would like to no longer stick here, I think. Ah, uh, and you can do it from here, too. Which is promising. A little bit. You can go up here and do that, but now you're stuck this way. So that's another, like, issue here. An alternative way that happens to have an issue. So, like, is there a way to do this and just push this down? That would be the way I'd want it to be. And do this, but then you can't get back out the same way. You can do it from above, but again, you can't go back down and fix it. Like, this is not the only way the hat can be configured. We could go, whoops, we could do this and attract the box. Why not? This is slightly different, but not usefully different. Eh. So we go in here? <laughs> no. Hmm. I remember before that we were able to push the box. Is there a way to dismount these and then, like, fix the whole issue? Because that seems like something we did previously. Oops. Well, we, we want to fix the issue when? On a previous step? Doesn't seem likely. Hmm. Ah, if you do that, you get stuck. So you go here, do what I just did, and 
Oh, the box is used as a recovery tool. Okay. Ha <laughs> ha Okay, that's a good one. Nice. Okay, level 28. Oh, that's big. But really, we're only trying to get this moved up and to the right, I think. What kind of spaghetti structure am I making here? This is like jelly is sticky. Okay. You go in here, push this up, and then a right move from here is translated to a right move on the very top. So whatever I do to this push somehow is also pushed here, which means lots of stickiness. Um, okay. Enough jelly is sticky playing, which is, um, you know, obviously it's a puzzle game about sticking things to each other will get you used to that level of uh, line of thinking, I guess. Although I'm not completely sure where to start. Like, is it just a chain? The thing is, like, I kind of forgot how to play this game, but yeah, like, I'm not completely sure or exactly remembering how things <laughs> used to stick together. Ah, it's a little ridiculous to say that because I obviously just did a level where I had to use, but, but like, if something I'm doing here isn't correct. You know, it seems pretty close, though. I mean, all I really did wrong was not having to be more like this. Yeah, the, the move I should be doing is pushing a hat like that. Um, ugh, like, maybe here, right? I think I'm concerned about is the hats don't make an entirely smooth chain, but... Well, let's see if this is a failure or not. Let's do this, and then push this to the right. Of course. <laughs> okay, here's an actual planned approach to playing this game. Here. I think they even merge together like this. Like that that's the only way to explain this mismatch in up versus down. Do this maybe and then try to justify how this is right. By maybe pushing it with one of the other hats. Okay, we're safe from that. Um not safe from the underuse of blocks though. Maybe here? Uh what the heck? <laughs> I can do this. Is that good enough, actually? Because we have we have the space to the right. So this should work. I hope. Because all of it is sticking using the block it sees, plus the block that it's sticky to. Please? <laughs> Planning falling apart. Isn't this just like... Just switch this and this. Okay. Now, watch as this fails again. Nope, nope, it, it worked totally. There you go. So, okay. Not many levels left to go. Uh, hmm. Put this and this. Obviously, need to, like, warp through there or something. Just to get this up. And is it gonna be in a wall-stuck extravaganza? Or do we try to go infinite with something? Is this- maybe this is a puzzle where you only navigate with, uh, your infinite hat? Hmm. Like, to me, that would be a more fun concept. Okay. Than any normal level. Okay. Like, if we just do this, then everything is good, and I think the level is fun. Otherwise, screw you. <laughs> a little disappointing that the hat where, like, the phantom and the gold stack isn't, like, a, its own special graphic, maybe? I mean, it could also stack everything, and that feels bad, but still. Is this level looking like an elephant to you? I mean, it is not the only way to move this thing. I can do this. And then hope to abuse the sticking thing. That's a little promising, right? And I can move this up and then please to the right. Yes! 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 Don't need to engage with the middle part of the level at all. Very nice. Alright, what's this? Wow. That looks like a very simple level. Which is highly suspect. Huh. Just get through a barrier is what it looks to be, anyway. Is it actually? Shrug. Definitely do that. Well, we can do that. Mm. Like, this is the world where I... World, I say, but this is a section where I expect the infiniteness to happen. So any way of stacking these would be good. I assume maybe the solution will involve pushing things a little bit past each other so it can cause something like this. Hmm. I do this. We need to get, like, get, get back out. So, is, maybe it's, like, pushing this down? 
Maybe we need to push the entire thing down if we wanted that, though. See the edge of the puzzle are, like, allowing a little bit of free movement. Still can't seem to find a way to push this entire thing down, though. Which is what I want to see. One thing I kind of want to know is... Can you bring this... Oh, shoot. We want to push this down here, I think. Like, into this square. I don't even know we can do that without ruining stuff. Hmm. Yes! That's what I was going for. Look, I wanted to get this square intentionally sticky while I was in Phantom so I can move this down. Is that enough, please? Yes! Yes! Okay. Okay, 31. This was like a hard level because of its placement on the map. What is going on here? Hmm. Well, it can definitely be inside a box. That's the whole idea, maybe? We're just supposed to try to box everything? Hmm. This entire thing, this tunnel, is all possible within having a 3x3 box, I assume? Well, I don't know what the G, uh, the J-I here is for. It's for GG, I guess. You know, the Baba character GG. Do notice that there's no way to cleanly fit these into a 3x3 without phantom abuse, of course. Well, you know, there's an easy way. Plus, there you go. Oh, but it, but it breaks apart really fast, huh? If we do that... It doesn't support itself. But then how is a J supposed to fit? That doesn't look good in the 3x3 at all. Unless that's supposed to be in the middle and the I is also in the middle. That's... Ugh. <laughs> like, interestingly, if you're on the... If you're on the outside, there are certain angles where pushing down and up are allowed. But not some other ones. By allowed, I mean they don't break the structure in a bad way. So if you move this all the way up and then what? I'm just doing this to test, like, the limits of this, because, I mean, not necessarily the case that I need to be on the inside, even though it is heavily suggested. So, I would like to phantom and get, what, this J in there? The I will only work, like, if I put this I in here, it would only work from one vertical, I think, because it relies on what side has only one block to push at its edge, because if we imagine this I piece went over here, then a down move from the center of here would also cause the top block to move because this piece would be up here and cause a down move on the upper half. But that wouldn't work for both sides, which is why I would probably need to get the J into place and not the I. Is this real? Like, as in, does this work? I would imagine you also want to not screw up with the hat placement like I did. Instead, so this moves down to make it work. Maybe put the J in first. Wait, move this. Okay, and then, of course, I knew that way I had to probably do this because we used it in the previous level. Oh, wait, it doesn't even work the way I thought it would. Oh, jeez. Just wanted to get into the center one. Okay, well, here's an alternative idea. We just move this down and go into the left tile, perhaps? Because all we need to do is... No, I was trying to get into here, but that's not going to work. I, I want to be able to push left, down, and up, and left. So the right move's not necessary. But that being said, I can't seem to find a place where it will work anyway. Maybe we do need the eye after all. Like, alternatively, we could try to set this up while being in the center here. But that would require getting it off later on, which is another odd concept. Like, here. Yeah, hmm. Maybe up here? What well, you would do this. Hmm. Hmm, no. no. Let's try it from, like, below. So we can do here. Yep. Well, that's the move I would want to see. Okay, we can do it from below, maybe. No. Well, we do that. Shoot. So what? What is the goal there? Do we already have this prepared, like that? And then, I'm gonna maneuver ag again. That is close, but no. That's close to the idea I want to do. Hmm, we could do that. And then knock this out at the end. Yes! Not sure how symmetrical this uh, solution was. I mean, you can definitely start by doing this trick on the other side as well. But okay, we got the the eyepiece in the way. <laughs> it is interesting, though. Like, what is the... I, I didn't seem to need to use it at all, so could that could have been cheese. Anyway, we got it. Okay, 32. Well, we're um, immediately in ridiculous room. Ah, okay. 
Hmm. And there's... Wow, what is going on in this level? Like, what, three different challenges? Hmm. Okay. Maybe sped through the first part a little too fast, but we also can't do any other moves besides this. Is that all forced? Hmm. Like, we can also, like, kind of maneuver around there. Hmm. And, like, try to avoid that part and push this in. Uh, this is all completely experimental, by the way. So, the thing at the bottom right of this level is, is an anti what I just did right there. I am supposed to not push this to the left. But, what is the goal about pushing here? I'm supposed to push, I'm supposed to push this up, right? And then, I need to get out and then push that again. I don't know where, when I, where I end the level at. Can I just stick this up here and get it super out of the way and then I can push this in here? Okay, maybe that's the way to end the level, because that brings the bunny here. So if I was able to get this in place, then it's all fine. Don't want to get that push, though. Okay, how do we get that to happen without pulling the bottom right, which is what we want to avoid? Hmm. Not from the top, I just... Wow. Like, this is one of those levels where you break the... Con conceived concept of this double hat here is it no you must use this hat and push left. okay well not push but pull to the left but still i think i have a little bit more of an idea now just want to kind of dismount this hat as well so this hat is meant to be put up here well i can figure out a way to dismount that or i could just you know wear it maybe Again, we will need to dismount again still. So we can get it stuck here. And then what? Try to get it back. But once we have this. Oh, come on. Please. Please. Hmm. Down and then left is where we want it there. Wait, that's not really correct. Because the way this works, I feel like this might stick to here as well. So we need something in the way. Either this is actually over here. Or. The top hat sticks to this first and then this because all sticking um also kinds of kind of sticks to the four-way adjacency okay, the top hat there and i don't know I'm, i i swear i'm gonna get this soon i mean it looks very soonish here so okay maybe this is too much of a dismount mm. yeah no that double side hat needs to be completely elsewhere probably Okay, this is the most free we've been again. But again, like, this will not work because of the way the stickiness works, so we have to do specifically that. But, wait. Oh my gosh, I needed to... <laughs> oh, I needed to be below or something, because I need to finish the level at the bottom. Uh, hmm. Wait, doesn't this mean that my idea here could have been also duplicated by having the double-sided hat, like, here and here? So all I really need might be to put it here... Um, so go down. I believe that hat does go down there then. Oh. <laughs> Just so much for that effort, huh? About trying to put the top hat. Yep. Total memory forgetitude. I don't know. But yeah, you can do that. And then that section is finished. Now, I don't know about here, but it probably should be easy from here. I don't know. Moving up is hard, actually, from there. Would wish to have another way to dismount, and unfortunately, the best way to dismount would have been to keep the top hat in a slightly better position down here. So what, like, earlier on, did I- should I just, like, have done this? Or this? So we go here... And we switch positions? Yes! I think this is it. There we go. So yeah, I kind of tunnel vision onto the top, but eventually figured it out. Okay, 33. What do we have here? And do that. Is it, is it, this is a very explicit infinite if that's what we're doing here. Hmm. Hat position is a little awkward. We'd prefer these to merge. Okay, but and then we need a dismount. And I don't know if I did it properly or not. We're stuck together because of the way the the uh, gold hat is still sticking here. Gold hat, get out of here. I don't know. Shh. Gold hat, it does not appear you are leaving. This is an unfortunate circumstance. It's interesting that, like, if we do this, you notice that the icon, it's very hard to tell, but the box represents that this piece is no longer phantomed anymore because, well, it, it's gotten out due to the hat. 
we were to push this in, can we later fix the problem of being phantomed and get this onto the box? We need to be completely out of there. Which means that I would not want to be phantomed at some point. <sighs> Dang it. So, so close there. But I don't want it to stick. That's the thing. If we do this, the only direction I can go is up. Like, it just feels so close. Besides, you know, that you can't win if one of the rabbits is in phantom. Dang, if you do this, is pretty close. So you can do this, and then I'm not phantomed anymore. The only problem is I, did, I haven't moved this piece yet. I don't know if it's possible to, like, go here, move this piece, and then make it all the way back to the start. Mm, does not look possible. I actually get the inverse scenario. But, you know, pushing this to the right stinks too. Did that by just, like, switching going up and down around here. Like, I did this instead, I think. Yep. Well, I haven't tried other things, but it feels like it could really spaghetti if you did other things. And it's sticking. Wonderful. Hmm. This game really epitomizes the concept of going down the rabbit hole. Because there's so many alternate possibilities with everything. You can stack two rabbits on top of each other. Arrgh. Here's something I haven't tried. Let's put it in the left side of the wall instead. Why not? Okay, well... <laughs> okay. <laughs> wow, so simple. No, okay. This is the last level. Seems a little anticlimactic, isn't it? Well, we have two carrots up there. When we try to get this out, we would probably need to use techniques to do that. We need that phantom block out, don't we? So let's go infinite again. Or try to, at least. Get it, Please go infinite. There we go. So now this is being carried. Now I want that phantom not there anymore. Um, hmm. Maybe I messed up. Hmm. Like, I could do it here. That doesn't stop the problem of the phantom is, um, is hugely in the way right now. Like, I, I, I want it to help a little bit, and then I don't want to see it anymore. Like, there's no way that we're just ignoring the box when it comes to doing this, right? Because there's no way to mess with it if you only have this. Therefore, the box is a required part of moving this, I think. So that we can continue sticking. Oh, jeez, but... But what about all the other stuff? Great, we've got- we've managed to get the whole bunny in the back configuration. Is that- I don't know if that- is that what we're calling it? <laughs> oh, that is a left-facing phantom hat and an up-facing gold hat and a bunny on a box all in the same tile. Uh, yeah, I don't know either. Really, the tile you want to see this is really here, so you could be a phantom here, not a phantom on this wall, and then move this up. But then you have to deal with, like, get this out of here. Wait, does this actually work? Mm, but, but you'd want this, like, on here instead. And once we also push this upwards, push this onto this tile. Up, please. No. We got a hat cream cone, I don't know. No. Wait. That is actually the nicest thing that's happened so far? If only I was like, I don't know, at the bottom of the tile instead. Hmm. That is so close. I'm gonna try a different approach to trying to get this piece in here. I can merge this. How's that to happen? And I can pull it over. Okay, that is ins that's really good. Well, I say that's really good, but I need to push this one to the left again. I don't know if I can do that. Why? Why can't it? Is it because I'm sticking? Hmm. I would like to push that one to the left now. Maybe because there's, there's a wall in the way, which is another reason why. Hmm. I'd like to push that one to the left. Yes! Yes! Okay, that's that's it, huh? I think that's it. Unless there's some meta stuff that freaking unlocked here, but I don't think so. Yeah, Hat Trick's Heron Box, everyone. That's every level in there. 
Glad I went back and uh, got myself rid of that roadblock at level 25, I think. Uh, but yeah, I was kind of hoping there was something meta in the world, but still. Hat tricks, hair and box. Bye.